Hello everyone, this is Yash Saxena and you are watching Swadeshi VIP. And today we are going to talk about the photosensitization in cows. Green pastures and sunshine, what can be more idyllic? There are times, however, when that bucolic scene can be deadly. Photosensitization in cattle is uncommon, but when it occurs, it can be a serious problem. Photosensitization is a serious skin and occasionally liver condition that causes sunburn, crusty white or non-pigmented skin on cattle. Photosensitization occurs when the presence of chemical make skin become sensitive to sunlight, particularly UV wavelengths. This leads to skin damage and loss. It is not very common in India, but it causes significant economic loss, particularly when it occurs in groups of animals. There are three sorts of photosensitization. Direct photosensitization occurs when the chemical comes from a defect in animal's metabolism of its red blood cells or more commonly from plants such as St. John's wort. Next is secondary photosensitization occurs in animal with liver damage, interferes with the complete breakdown of chlorophyll, resulting in the accumulation of photosensitive chemicals. Local photosensitivity can also result as a reaction to the sap of some plants. Most commonly affected sites are those exposed to direct sunlight, including the udder, which is exposed when the animal lies down. Now let's talk about the clinical signs. Non-pigmented skin affected, hair loss, reddening, peeling, ulceration of skin, crusting, bleeding are some of the clinical signs. How you will diagnose? Let's talk about the diagnosis. A veterinary diagnosis is important in order to rule out liver failure. In case the veterinary can find out from the clinical signs, those are just the only option for the veterinary also to find out whether your cattle is suffering from the photosensitization or not. Next, we are going to talk about the treatment. Treatment includes removal to cool shaded housing, fly control in the area where the cattle are living, supportive therapy, treatment of liver failure if present, etc. With treatment, prevention is also very important. To prevent this to spread in your cattle herd, do these things. Do not breed from the animal with photosensitization due to a genetic defect identity and remove possible plant sources of photosensitizing chemicals. So this was all about the topic. For more such videos on cattle health and dairy products, Subscribe to our channel Swadeshi VIP. This is Yash Saxena signing off.